skirts. The black t-shirts are from Canamania from us. Uh, I think they're from us. Um, either that or they're pissed off potheads. Uh, they, no, they're pissed off pothead dot, dot, dot com. This next thing here, I'm giving away in a tiny gift bag. What this is, is it's 100% uh, vegan. I gave one away earlier. 100% vegan uh, molasses-based nutrients. Uh, it's really good. Uh, this is all I use, the Atomic Because products. I mean, they're the oldest company in the business. They started all this. They, they created the first plant-intensive specific nutrient you know, for doing what we do. They're the masters. All these other companies like Advanced and all these other people, all they do is they emulate what this one does. Why buy something that emulates what the master does when you can buy the master? Why buy something that you gotta buy 500 different additives to it to make it work? Why buy something that you gotta spend five grand out of your pocket to make a run on your plants? That's just ludicrous, really, seriously. This is a three-part nutrient. You got a, a bloom, a flavor, and a, a, a bench. What the deal is, it's got uh, three additives that are part of the process that you don't even really necessarily have to use. So basically this is a standalone three-part nutrient that it's very user-friendly, very, very user-friendly. You don't even have to, to pH your water when you're mixing it. Just tap water, drain it, and run it out of the tap mix your nutrients up and go with it. I've never had one problem with any kind of lockout, any kind of discoloration, anything across the board with these nutrients. Ever. Plus there's the fact that it's 100% nutrient. All of us have had to cut our plants fast, you know, one to, at one point or another, and for some reason didn't get to flush the plant fully. Well, guess what? It's 100% vegan. That means it doesn't color the taste at all. When you're feeding a plant with a plant, there's no other kind of funky taste that can get in there, is there? These additives, the flower additive, the blossom additive, what this does is it causes the plant to go in and produce its own terpenes. The terpenes of the plant are your flavor, your smell, what make the colors colorful, what makes your purples purple, so on and so on and so forth. It also makes it produce another valuable terpene in the plant, the THC and the CBD. It also makes the plant produce a whole lot more trichomes. My plant, my, my, my product, whenever I bring it in the house, hands down, it wins. I've been begged at Harry's Hill to enter my product, and I didn't do it because it wasn't fun. I've been begged to enter my product in contests. No, I can't do it. It's not fair. I have an edge. My edge is a tiny place. All right, along with this. We have some product that isn't even on the market yet. It's called Gloss Builder. It's a finishing additive. You use one milliliter to the gallon. It makes the plant put a spur on a, a final phase of flowering, and it also makes your uh, the uh, buds swell. Uh, it's kind of like um, I don't know. I call it uh, Bert, uh, Bush Master, but uh, the flower heart right there from. Yeah, gravity flower heart. It's kind of like that, but only this is it's different. They not only does it, in, 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 you know, they make this make it swell, but it's also got the uh, blossom additive in it, so that it makes it swell with the flavors with the terpenes and stuff. Yeah, it bulks out the terpenes, so it's kind of like an added boost to your to your potency, so to say, and flavor and smell. Um, I'm going to give this package away along with the last bit of genetics in the house. Compliments of Brendan again. Good selection of his own head stock. I think there's like five or six different packs of seeds in here. Uh, and I've also got uh, some medicinal mix to go along with this. What he's going to do, what GW is going to do is he's going to turn around and he's going to give you two of those uh, one cubic foot uh, burlap bags of his medicinal mix and two of the bags of the starter mix as well. I don't know if you guys know too much about that stuff, but man, I went and saw the guy. It's incredible what he, had, what he does and what he puts out. The guy lives, first off, I'm going to tell you the story, he lives totally off grid. He lives on the side of a mountain, his family's on the mountain for over 150 years. He lives like his grandfather's lived. No electricity, no running water, no heat, no nothing. This guy has 
candles burning in his house. He heats with a wood stove, a pot belly wood stove in his kitchen, and they use an outhouse outside to go to the bathroom. I thought that was pretty rustic, but you know what? When the, when the shit hits the fan, he's going to make it. So I went and I checked out his dirt, the way he makes his uh, compost, and I'm going to tell you it's pretty impressive. He puts whole chicken carcasses in there. If he needs calcium in his feed, he doesn't add something to the dirt. He feeds his chicken. He feeds his hens ground up uh, oyster shells. I don't know if there's any other 100% organic, organic natural ways to add calcium to your dirt. This guy knows what he's doing. He's got great product. I can attest to it. I tested some of it out when I went and I sold in the booth. I couldn't believe what, the, what it did to my plants. It's, I didn't even, he's got it so that the burlap bags, you can take and plant a seed in it and it, it set it out next to a creek or wherever and it'll grow right in the bag. I didn't even do that. I took and I made a, a I use a, a pea uh, cocoa mix, 50-50 of each. Well then I turned around and I infused it with a 50% mix of his medicinal mix and I'll tell you my plants rocked. Definitely good stuff. So anyway, I'm giving you a whole complete package here. The only thing you need are the pots. I'm going to give it to the caregiver or patient who can think of the number between 50 and 65. 57! 62, there you go, 62, right there, there you go, guy. Now, you're going to take the piece of wooden block, or there's a wooden chunk there, it says winter on it, bring that over to GW's, the medicinal mix booth, and they'll hook you right up. Are you patient or caregiver, or are you a, uh, yeah, you're not a caregiver, dude. Uh, All right, sorry about that, guy. Where's the... All right. Number between patient and caregiver only, okay? This is genetics here. I just broke the law by handing in these genetics. Y'all gotta watch this stuff, please. I don't wanna go to jail. Don't need that. Joking. See, I just incriminated myself. This is how brutally honest I am. All right, patient and caregiver only, please, between the numbers 75 and 95. 88! 92, I heard 92, right over here. There you go. Now, you take that block over, here's the attitude. It's not even on the market yet, so. You, you, you got my contact. If you need any information on that, I'll, I'll come over and I'll help you with it. All right, man. Anyway, I'm going to give this microphone back to Mr. King of Pot so he can introduce the next person. Let's go, boys. Thank you very much, Jim. Jim Fowler with all those giveaways. Get up with Jim Fowler. He put us together. Yeah. We want a lot of people to come to the front right now because we gave you some music, and now we're going to give you some comedy. He, he played uh, last night here in the stage, and again, there were a bunch of other... Los Marijuanos was here, um, Gunhouse Hill, and uh, there were only a few people in the audience last night. We were privy to a very private uh, concert last night. That, that, uh, yeah, I know. Was it awesome you were there? Okay. So you can, you know what I'm talking about. We had the 420 comic. He flew, he flew out from Los Angeles along with Los Marijuanos. These guys and I, these cats go back with me, okay? When I first started out in this, on MySpace, remember MySpace? What? Huh? What's yeah, some of you still use it? Well, I met this cat that I'm going to bring out next. And uh, him and I have been friends over the internet all through the years, probably about seven years now. And we never met until last, yesterday, I, I believe. I, I, he came to my house and I took him up to here for this event. And uh, we, I found out that we got, we're kindred spirits. When we finally met, we're really kindred spirits. And uh, I made a new friend, a new, a new family friend, and uh, I want to bring him out. His comedy's great. He does it down in California. And now he's going to do it for you and me. Everybody, Jeffrey Beeson, the more 20 comic. Yeah. Our brother from another mother right here. Give it up for KLP. Yeah. He is the shit in New England, man. This guy is the man. Keep it going for Jim Fowler, too, for putting this shit on. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
this is uh, this is actually reserved for my uh, entourage, so don't anybody sit there, please. Let's keep this quick. So I get how you guys are, how you guys have walked away. Unless we're giving shit away, you don't want to come over here. Yeah. I'm giving away free pot right now. I'm giving away free weed right now, see you fuckers. I got marijuana. I got a huge. I got like a pound right here. I'm giving it away. So as soon as you lose, these two ladies right here, they know what's up with the KOP right there. Give it up for. The, the sexy ladies of New England. Hey, you're just my style. I'm a ghost lover. You guys, I like the ghosts. I like the old. Yeah. In fact, I was, I was kind of excited about, about performing out here, you guys. I had, to, uh, I had to rub one off to calm myself down. And don't get, don't get your mind in the gun. I wasn't watching porno. I was watching my favorite TV show, Hot in Cleveland. Ooh, yeah. Valerie Bertinelli, Jane Leaves, Betty White. That's just my style, a 92-year-old stoner. That's just what I want. I want to get involved with a lady like that so I can, you know, be in her, in her inheritance. That would be fucking awesome. Look, my girlfriend left me a pound of weed. That's fucking awesome. So you guys are having some great weather here. You guys are having some fantastic... I didn't expect it to be this 